Hello and good evening, this is Ruth Pozuelo from Curva.com and uh, today I want to sh share with you a trick that I learned from somebody else uh, on how to remove duplicates based on sort date in Power BI. So let me explain a little bit more what I mean and what the issue is. So this trick I actually received from Paul Paul uh, Lucassen. <laughs> I'm sure I'm not saying the, the surname right, but he shared this with me when he was working on a project and had that problem. And actually, it was somebody else that helped him uh, figure that out, and it was Andreas here. He has a YouTube channel on Power BI and Power Query and Excel. Uh, unfortunately, it's in German, so if you know German, make sure that you check him out. Uh, but for us that we don't, I'm going to show you how to to fix that the issue with duplicates in Power Query. So first of all, what is the issue? I have here in Excel a very simple data set and let's imagine that here is a list of customers and in here we have the time that they visited a company, your company. And you would like to get a list with the last date they visited. So you don't want to know about the previous visits, just when was the last time they were at your company. We say so. And in Excel, what you can do is you would go into uh, data and then remove duplicates. And then you say you want to remove them by customer. And as you can see, what Excel does is it just removes, it keeps the first date it finds. So the first date it finds is the 1st of December, but that's not exactly what we wanted, right? We wanted to get the last date. So what we need to do is sort these by oldest to newest, sorry, to oldest. And now, when we ha once we have done the sort, we will go to remove duplicates again by customer and we will get a list of the last dates. So in Excel, no problem, but when we go into Power Query, you will realize that you cannot do that. Let me show you. Okay, so we have exactly the same data set now in Power BI in Power Query and we're going to do exactly the same thing. So we have here is October and December and we want the December date so we will go into customers and do remove duplicates and we have the same problem as in Excel only October is uh, kept and we know in Excel that if we sort these sorry not there we sort it there then Excel remembers, uh, keeps the first ones. So let's see if it works in Power Query. It doesn't. You see, it's keeping the October. So it keeps the table in memory. And then it does not remember the sorting part. It just remembers the first time. And that's why the trick that you do in Excel does not work in Power Query. So what we need to do is actually sorted. You will sort the, the list. And now we need to say, okay, keep this new sort in order in memory instead of the old one. And to do that, we go to advanced editor. And once in here, we're going to add this step. What we're seeing here, table buffer, what it says is remember the previous step. You tell Power Query, which step you want it to remember in there. So table, buffer, sorted rows, right? And now we remove that, we put a comma there, and we add these as the last step because that's the one we want executed. And then done. So now Power Query or Power BI is remembering this order. And once that happens, we can do remove duplicates and it will remember that and remove the 
the older dates and keep the, the latest ones, the ones that we want to keep. So this is quite a nice uh, trick. Now you might be wondering why are you doing that? You could use last date instead. Yes, of course. This is just an example. So I just wanted to show you in the case that you want to remove duplicates in order in the, in the latest date order, for example, then this is what you need to do because what you're doing in Excel, it will not work in Power BI. Short video today, but hopefully useful if you encounter this problem. So this is all for today. If you liked the video, please let me know by liking it. If you have any comments, questions or suggestions, uh, let me know in the comment box or any of the social channels listed below. And please subscribe. I publish Power BI videos every week. Have a great evening.